Hi friends, welcome, if it is the first time with you, subscribe to never miss an upload. In this video, you are going to watch, 10 places women want to be touched. So, watch until the end of video, because many guys and men are not aware of place, number 8, number 9, and number 10. We all know which female body parts men most frequently like to explore, but there is more to her than a vagina, breasts, and butt. The largest amount of nerve endings may be packed into those areas, but she has pleasure sensors all over her body. And getting her in the mood may be as easy as stimulating some of these often neglected parts. Incorporating touching these places into foreplay and sex, or just giving her some pleasure after a hard day, will definitely earn you some brownie points. Number 1. Earlobes. Touching, kissing, and even lightly biting the earlobes of your woman will up the bliss factor for her. These delicate, Soft lobes are very sensitive and most women thoroughly enjoy the sensation of having a man's lips on them. You can nibble around the outside of the rest of her ear as well, but for courtesy's sake avoid jamming your tongue inside her ear. Number 2. Hair. Maintaining their gorgeous locks isn't the only reason women go to their hair stylists so often. The process of wash, cut, color, and styling can actually be quite a stress reliever. Running your hands gently through her hair is a surefire way to send tingles down her spine. Let your fingers massage circles from her temples to the nape of her neck and she'll be putty in your hands. Number 3. Small of her back. The best way to guide your woman through a crowd is to place your hand against the small of her back. This small gesture shows that you feel protective of her without being too pushy like an arm around a shoulder might be. When you're alone, kissing or licking down her spine to end up with a kiss on the small of her back will get her heart racing. Number 4 nape of her neck once you get to the nape of her neck place a few light kisses there in ancient japan the back of a woman's neck was seen as very attractive by men since it was one of the few places not covered by clothing in modern times the nape of the neck is often neglected in favor of more obvious pleasure centers but never underestimate the power of gentle touches and kisses from her hairline to her shoulders. Number 5. Clavicle. A well-defined clavicle, or collarbone, can be very sexy on a woman. Why not show your appreciation for its beauty with your touch and kiss? Pay attention to this body part while she's still fully clothed, unbuttoning her shirt just enough to reveal the clavicle and no further. You can always come back to it once the clothes have disappeared as well to remind her of the anticipation it created when you started there. Number 6. Behind her knees. This area is one that most men don't think of when trying to stimulate a woman, but it is, in fact, quite sensitive. Gently caressing the back of the knee under her skirt while the two of you are in a public place will make her ready to get busy once you get home. Don't forget to pay some more attention to this special spot once you're alone too. Number 7 palms of her hands people often use their hands as tools to please their partners 
but rarely do they consider the pleasure potential of stimulating the hands themselves. The palm of a woman's hand is an innocuous spot to focus a little attention on without making people around you uncomfortable. Tracing your finger along her palm will give her delightful shivers and make you appear sensitive and attentive. Number 8. Feet. Pulp Fiction taught us that rubbing the feet of another man's wife may be an offense punishable by being thrown out a window. So the sensual appeal of a foot massage is obvious. There are few better ways to help her relax than to give her feet a good rub. Especially if her job requires her to be on them all day. Do it right and grab some massage oil or lotion. Don't forget to pay some attention to her toes, ankles, and the sides of her feet too. Some women really enjoy having their toes sucked, but others find it repulsive, so asking first is a good idea before putting them in your mouth. Number 9. Inner Thighs Touching her inner thighs without venturing into the vaginal area will make for an excellent tease that is sure to get her revved up. Use your hands and mouth to caress and kiss the insides of her thighs. Getting excruciatingly close to her ultimate pleasure spot, but pulling back before going all the way. Number 10. Pelvis. Concentrating some affection on her pelvis is a great idea, however, you'll have to resist the urge to slip down to her vagina while you're so close. Like teasing her inner thighs, kissing and licking around her pelvis will excite her until she's begging for more. Prolong the sensation by leaving the region to focus on another body part for a while. Every inch of her body is covered with nerve endings that could be stimulated, but that doesn't mean that she doesn't have some no-go places. Some women can't stand to have their faces touched, while others find it unbearable if their hands are tickled. As you explore, you'll learn which places your touch has the best effect on and which you should avoid. Thank you for watching, subscribe and rise thumbs up if you like video.